An ABC6 crime alert new video just released tonight of a man who police say deliberately hit a veteran with his car. It happened at a Northeast Columbus Speedway back in June. The victim tells ABC6's Terry Sullivan it was all over a dollar. Igwabi K. Madamalu wheels into a Westerville park. He hasn't been able to walk since June when he says he was deliberately hit by a car at a gas station all over a dollar. I just stole money out of the money, you know. Two seconds later, he told me he was going to run me over. Now, when you look at the guy, like I could tell he was high off of some drugs, whatever. Store security caught the man in a blue shirt briefly inside the store. Outside, he wasn't taking no for an answer. He got into his car. He backed up about eight feet. And I was, um, I thought it was about to leave the gas station. As soon as I took my eyes away from him, he just sped up and smashed my leg, pinned it against the wall. Amazingly, he didn't have any broken bones, but now suffers extensive nerve damage. He says the pain is excruciating. I can hardly concentrate on anything. I can hardly sleep. He lost his job and his full scholarship to Columbus State, where he was studying software programming. Medical bills are mounting, and no sign of the guy in the blue shirt. Columbus police hope to capture this guy very soon. Madamillo's goal is to walk soon on two healthy legs. In Westerville, Terry Sullivan, ABC6 News.